Hello everyone, this is Ethan. Welcome back to another episode of Display and Tech Review. Today I'm going to show you the simple calibration settings for this piece of technology. This is the Dell S2817Q. It's a production uh, monitor with a 60 hertz display. It's actually pretty good with a three millisecond input lag. So let's get to it. So first, if you can and you have it hooked up to a computer or a PC, make sure you download the Dell Display Manager. It's compatible with this monitor and make sure you open it. Once you open it, you're going to go to, to the manual mode and you're going to choose the custom mode here and then on the brightness. We get a little bit closer. You're gonna go, you're gonna put the brightness at 25%. That puts it around 130 nits. 130 nits of brightness. You could go to whichever you decide, but for content reason, 25% is around the the desire for um non HDR displays and then on contrast to get the best detail out of the white highlights and you don't get white um, white clippings <clears throat> and you don't get white clipping then you put it at around 81% it could be a little bit higher like 83 or 84 but I like to drop it a little more so I can see more detail of it then you can turn it off and then go to the settings. And then on settings, you're going to go, as I showed you, 25% and 81% on contrast. You're going to go to the color. And then on color, you're going to choose custom color. Obviously, in RGB, no YCBCR. Custom color, and then go to the bottom, which is already chosen, since I already did it. Choose it again, and then on red, you're gonna leave it at 100%. And green, unfortunately, you have to touch this time and drop it to 90. And blue is the one that you mostly gonna have to touch, and then you're gonna just gonna drop it to 80% that will give you a lot more accurate colors out of this 4k display and a more enjoyable gaming when gaming on on pc or if you use it for consoles and that's the simple calibration method so that's it guys that was the simple calibration method to make the monitor a lot more um, accurate and on gaming, you will see a difference. You will see the colors pop more and see a lot more detail. So I hope you like this. And I see you next time.